well, the reason why I probably <coughs> looked as uh, I'm looked upon as though I, I'm a pillar, like you said, mm-hmm. um, because not only am I just am I in the valley doing business with Title, uh, which um, five more years I'll be retired hopefully, um, but uh, I'm in the community and I've been in the community for a long time, and that was obviously through athletics, through all my kids who played you know, high levels of soccer, uh, Division One soccer. Um, club soccer around town, and then I became the soccer guy, yeah. you know, known as Coach Tom. Coach Tom. And so uh, that was probably a lot of, of why I was successful in the business, mm. uh, because of just uh, my networking, uh, being a part of that community, uh, which I love and I miss now. I'm retired from it. But um, I think that made a big difference for, for me in terms of business and, and relationships that I've forged over the years in the Valley. And uh, so did you play soccer yourself? I didn't play, no. I was you a football player. And I was, you know, 5'7", I think I shrunk, right? My <laughs> wife says I'm 5'6", and I am. I think I was 5'9", at one point, though. <laughs> a towering um, Yeah, five exactly, nine. right. Um, so, no, I was a football player. I was actually an uh, all-state, all-league uh, football player as a running back and a cornerback wow. uh, in high school. And um, so that was my that – was, that's who I was then. You know, I, I wanted to be a professional football player, but at five seven, you're not gonna, you know, with, Step a, right with, over with you. a small frame, you're not gonna do it. Yeah. But uh, you know, it was, it was wishful thinking, and you know, put me on a path of of where I'm at today. Now, where did you grow up? Was this uh, Southern California? Yeah, thing? Southern California all, all, all my life. Um, West Covina. Okay. Uh, I went to Covina High School. I went to Mount Sac out there. Uh, I think I got in a couple semesters, and just figured, you know, what school's not for me. And um, got into bartending, uh, which really helped me with my business as well. Yeah. Taught me how to network. It taught me how to uh, create relationships, uh, start conversations. And uh, a lot of that, I've, a lot of what, what I do now, I learned back then. Um, establishing a base of customers that would come in. You know, some people would come as Tom here. No, he's not. And they'd leave. Yep. You know. Not, not because of the free drinks, but <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that helps. That helps. <laughs> it does. So, um, but uh, yeah, 